several months ago, rapper Sijam was arrested for illegally purchasing a total of 112 grams of marijuana on 10 occasions. Sijam was also charged for using marijuana three times with rapper Vasco and four other aspiring entertainers at a home in Seoul. They are also suspected of using 0.5 grams of cocaine. During his interrogation, Sijam admitted to using the drugs, believing it would help him create music. I thought it would be helpful when making music. Sijam, the prosecutors on his case are demanding a two year prison sentence and 16.45 million won, tilde $15,000 USD, in fines. The penalty is equivalent to those sentenced to previous cases dealing with the purchase of illegal marijuana. The prosecutors explained that they decided on their demands after carefully reviewing the time length and the rapper's remorse. We came to this demand after carefully considering the nature of the habitual crime that was committed over a long period of time, as well as their sincere reflection. Prosecution during the trial, C. Jam appeared nervous as he explained his motive behind the crime. He then gave a contrite statement and ultimately apologized to his parents. I started it because I thought it would help me relieve stress but now I think that was all excuses. I will never commit this crime again. I'm sorry, mom and dad. C. Jam C. Jam's lawyer revealed that C. Jam had actually participated in rehabilitation programs even before his arrest. He asked for leniency on his final sentencing, with all things considered. C. Jam's final trial will be held on August 10. C. Jam confessed and repented of his crime since the investigation stage. He sought out rehabilitation programs himself, even before he was arrested. I ask that you also consider the fact that this is his first criminal offense and his social records are clear, C. Jam's lawyer BTS Jin ranked.